Hey, good morning. Welcome to North Country. Um, the two new pups, the Ranger pups, the Ranger Maggie pups, which uh, are uh, literally every hound breed there is, from uh, Running Walker to Virginia Foxhound, Plot, every every breed you can consider can conceivably think of. That's what they are. They're they're going to be uh, nine weeks old tomorrow. And this week, what we've done is we've played with them quite a bit. Uh, we got them uh, so that they'll come for a treat. I use a little bit of kibble there and uh, some, some, uh, some, some treats for them to get them to come. They, they're coming pretty regularly to me now. They're acclimated to the area and the other dogs. They're uh, very curious in what they're doing. And uh, they're starting to range out a little bit now. We've got quite a bit of woods here and, on the property, and they're starting to range out just a little bit. Stay pretty close to the kennels, but they're starting to range. So uh, they've already been shot up and wormed and everything, so they're, 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 they're safe in that environment. They're doing really well. So I'm keeping the fleas and ticks off of them. The, the, the ticks are just terrible here. It's, un, it's unbelievable. But uh, anyway, now tomorrow what will happen, I've been working them with a uh, tanned cat hide, and tomorrow we'll actually take a uh, frozen bobcat that was harvested this past winter, harvested and tagged. We'll take it out of the freezer, and we'll play with that a little bit. We'll, we'll drag some, uh, hopefully, some scent on, on that. I'll thaw it out a little bit, and we'll drag it around and see how they react. Uh, right here, just yard work. That's all there is right now is yard work. They're still just little babies. Nine weeks old doesn't mean they're, they're ready for the real woods yet, but they're, they're okay. They're okay here in the neighborhood. Everything seems to be going, uh, going fine. And they're healthy. They're growing. They eat good. They're social. So uh, they're, they're, they're na we have one named Carly, a little female, and then a black and white uh, male we call Jiggers. That was the, the first dog that I'd ever had, probably uh, eight, nine years old. So that, that's what we're gonna guess that we're gonna call this male. And I just want you to kind of follow along and see see how it goes as far as uh, what I'm doing as far as training these puppies to become full-grown cat hounds, which hopefully uh, we'll be able to start them on some cat tracks this winter. At uh, Well, they were born, uh, let's see, they were born uh, April 1st, so uh, we're going to have, they're going to be five, it'll be seven months old when our cat season opens up here, and at seven months, they should be able to take a track out. Hopefully by that time, they'll have been on a few squirrels and some rabbits and possibly a coon and uh, maybe even a bear or two come October. They'll be, they'll be old enough to throw in with the other dogs just on the right bear. I'll be very cautious with them at this point so that they don't get hurt. Uh, it has to be the right bear, and if it is, then uh, we may have them join the party. But at any rate, the progress is a, is, it's a slow process. Nothing happens overnight. It's all you're looking for is a little bit more activity, a little more something out of them every day, and watching their personalities, which is very important. Those personalities change, and, and their actions change. And, uh, so I'm quite confident that they're going to make some good dogs. The breeding is right. The, the, the father, the mother, the grandparents on both sides, the great-grandparents all the way back as far as you can think. With the, with those Coles cat hounds, they go back 80 years of the, just breeding the best, the very best of the best. And uh, on, on Tim Berry's side, the, uh, the, the, the female, which uh, is owned by a friend of mine, Paul, she's a nice dog, does a great job. And uh, they also go back to some great dogs. They go to some hard-time uh, English dogs and, and, and treeing walkers. Uh, there's some there's some curs in there, and I might even add there's a red bone somewhere in that lineage. I'm not exactly sure, but whatever it is, it's good stuff or it wouldn't be there. And that's what's important. You've got the right blood. I'm normally a plot person. Plots are what I run. Uh, I have my whole my whole yard is full of plot hounds, with the exception of Ranger and now those two puppies. So we'll see how they progress. Keep you posted. Thanks for subscribing to our channel. We appreciate your patronage, and I'll try to try to do justice to it for you the best I know how. Well, here we go. That's Carly, and that's Jiggers over there, male and female. Female's a little black one. Male's a little white one. This is the day they come home, and uh, as you can see. We're loaded up with puppy chow and a brand new stainless water bucket for them. So uh, this will be the beginning of uh, 
training. They might as well get right in the dog box right to start with. I think they'll be okay there, but just in case they're not, what I did here was uh, I brought a kennel crate with me there, and I can have them right up in the front seat. I don't dare leave them loose in the front seat yet because uh, they're crawling all over the place, and I do have to drive, but uh, there they are, cute as hell. And we're going to have a lot of fun with them, and my plan is to keep uh, different training different training programs going here throughout the uh, late spring and summer. So uh, we'll keep you posted on all of it, and uh, we're going to have them home in a minute, and two minutes, and we're going to give them their second shots today. They're eight weeks old on Sunday, so this is close enough. And uh, they've already been wormed a couple times, two or three times. Let's see. Uh, yeah, probably three times now. So the plan is to train these in and make them cat hounds. They're uh, got every considerable, every hound breed there is in their bloodline. I don't think there's any exception, including Kerr, Blue Tick, Black and Tan, Walker, everything you can think of. They got in them, English dogs. So uh, we're going to be pretty happy. We'll keep you posted. So come on, come on. Introduction to the kennel here. Here comes, uh, here comes oh. Jiggers. Come on, come on, Carly. Good girl, come on, over here. Over here. Oh, oh, oh. They'll have a big enough play area. I've got double kennel here, and they'll be, they'll be playing in both. Good, good boy, good boy. Good boy. Good boy, Jiggers. Carly decided to join the party here, so she's up here. And you get your water over there, plenty of water. We'll fill that one up with puppy chow. And you guys can have all you want to eat. Where is he? Oh, where is he? Where is he? Talk to him. Good boy. Good, good boy. Speak right to him. Good boy. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he, Elsa? Where is he? Where is he? Good boy, Jiggers. Good girl. Good girl, Carly. Where is he, Carly? Huh? Never mind her. Come on over here. Come on. Talk right to him. Good boy. Good boy. Talk to him. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Talk to him. Good boy. Good boy. Good girl. Good girl. Talk right to him. Oh, good boy. Talk to him. Jiggers. Jiggers. Here he is. Here he is. Talk to him. Oh, good boy. Carly, where is he, huh? Carly, talk to him. Good girl. Good girl. Where are they? Oh, good girl. Oh, good girl. Oh, good girl. Good girl. Where is he? Where is he, Carly? Huh? Good girl. Good girl. Get him, Carly. Oh, good girl. Good girl. Good boy, Jiggers. Good boy. Get him. Puppy pen is built. They're happy. A little bigger than 10 by 10, but it'll do the job. And uh, that's where they'll stay when uh, I'm out and about and they can't go with me. So it's a good safe place for them and plenty of room. So uh, hats off to Paul who helped me put it together. And uh, Sally, you're not going in there. That's not for you. Okay. Okay guys, you wanna come up and play or you wanna take a nap? Come on, let's go. Come on, Carly. Come on, Jiggers. Come on. Come on, Carly. Carly's a little black one. Jiggers is a little black and white one. Let's play a game. Wanna play a game? Come on. Jiggers, come. Come on. Let's play a game. Good girl, good girl. Yeah. Oh, good girl. Good girl. 
Oh, you got fur in your mouth, huh? Hey, where's your Carly? Carly? Where is he? Where's your Jiggers? Talk to him. Speak to him. Got a whole mouth full of fur, didn't you, huh? Speak to him. You gonna talk to him? Where is he? Hey, Carly, where is he? Where is he? What'd you get? What'd you get? Huh? You're not gonna say nothing today, huh? Let me see something. See, what'd you get? A whole mouth full of cat fur. Look at that. I'll put that right in the tray. We'll do this. We're gonna rub it on the tree, just like that. We'll put it right there. And there. Now let's see what happens. Talk to him. Good girl. Good girl. Where is he? Speak to him. Speak to him. Come on. Speak to him. Come on. <laughs> I guess that ain't gonna happen today. Where is he, Carly? Where is he, Carly? Good girl. Good girl. Where is he? Oh. Good boy, Jigger. Good boy. Where is he? Talk to him, Carly. Talk right to him. Where is he, Carly? What is that, huh? Talk to him. Good girl. Oh, good girl. Good girl, Carly. Good girl. Talk to him. Game, Carly. Game. Where is he? Talk to him. Carly, where is he? Where is he? Come on, talk. Where is he? Good girl. Oh, good girl. Where is he? Oh, good boy, Jiggers. Good boy. Where is he, Jiggers? Oh, good boy. Talk to him. Talk to him. Oh, good boy. Good boy, Jiggers. Good boy. Talk, to him. Talk right to him. Good boy. Oh, good boy. What a good boy you are. Oh, good boy. Good Jiggers. Talk to him. Where is he, Jiggers? Talk to him. Good boy. Good boy, Jiggers. Good boy. Talk to him. Good boy, Jiggers. Good boy. Good boy, Jiggers. Good boy. Talk right to him. Good boy. Good girl, Carly. Good girl. Where's he, Jiggers? Huh? Talk right to him. Good boy, Jiggers. Hey, dogs. Good boy. Good boy, Jiggers. Where's he? Good boy. Oh, good boy. What a good boy you are. Oh, what a good boy you are. Talk right to him. That a boy. Carly trying to dig that chipmunk out of the hole. She started making game on it before. Now she knows he's in there, so. She's, uh, I'm gonna poke around in there and see if she can't find him. Where is he? Where is he? Good girl, good girl. Get you, leave your brother, leave her, Jiggers, leave her alone. Where is he, Carly? Carly, talk to him. Jiggers, get out of there. Yeah, leave it to a male puppy to ruin a good shot. Yeah, here she was, treeing on that dead eye. And he's gotta keep bugging the hell right out of her. That's not working. It's gonna have to come out in the next round. All right, keep you posted. They like to bay up the puppies in the bushes. The pups don't seem to mind either. They got quite a game going there. Huh? 
they know Sally's got a chain and only reach so far. So they're pretty brave. There goes yours. He snuck under the chain and got back in there. They have absolutely no fear of the big dog. I can tell you that. They love to play with them. It's crazy how they play with them. Sally, be gentle. Be a good girl. They love, they love Piper. Don't you, huh? That's called socialization right there, I guess. I stay pretty close to make sure they don't get tangled up in the chain. But they have quite a game going on here. This was just an introduction video so you get a chance to meet Carly and Jiggers. There's going to be more extensive puppy training videos put out by Sam coming soon. Please stay tuned and thank you for subscribing.